the driver's tyres, everything is constantly working. Uh, from the first corner all the way through to the hairpin and then through the basically flat out left hander that's preceding this long right. And then, in fact, to be honest, Louise, until they get onto the big long back straight, you're always turning. So there's G-force on the driver. On the tyre, there's a lot of load. And it's long, fast corners as well, as you said. So it's pretty tough in terms of uh, the tyre wear and the way that you set up the car. Another thing about this corner just there, there's a bump. You see the rear moving up and down and then some oversteer on the exit because that's a changing track surface and it's got less grip than the previous sector. So you come through thinking, yep, everything's okay. You hit the bump and suddenly the car starts moving and sliding at the same time. And what about overtaking? That's very tricky. You can overtake in an LMP car round the outside in the left hander, but you've got to get it done early because a GT car has to turn in to this corner at one point. But then the other thing is with that less grip, when you are overtaking round the outside here, you tend to sort of lose the speed advantage you have. But in the race, even more critical than that, you get a lot of pickup in this corner. And so therefore the line gets narrower and narrower and you tend to sort of squeeze up against each other as you get the overtaking done in the braking area.